Hi guys, okay, it's Monday. It is Vlogmas Day 5. I can't believe it's already Vlogmas Day 5. Getting a water, because I'm about to have my, I don't know if you call this breakfast or lunch. It's a turkey sandwich with cheese and lettuce. Um, but it's only 9.35 in the morning. Um, sometimes I want breakfast and sometimes I just don't. I haven't put on my lipstick, so that's why my lips look so white. I am, I have a meeting this morning with um, a designer that we're working with for our closet. So very exciting. We're talking about rug options or carpet options. And my mom just texted me. I, what was I gonna say? I'm gonna finish up. I edited the vlog from yesterday, vlog to say four. I'll link that down below. I should do that. I need to be linking the pre previous day in the description bar for each day. Um, but I already edited that. I need to make the thumbnail and do the links, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now while I eat my sandwich and get going. So I'm getting ready to, it's been a little while. Um, it's like lunchtime now and I'm getting ready to prep for dinner. I'm gonna put some stuff in the crock pot. I thought I would show you what I'm cooking and just an easy meal that I like to make. I think I've shared this on my Instagram. It's not healthy by any means, but it's super easy. And I'll give you like a variation of how I cook it, but let me pull out my crock pot and get everything ready. And then I will be back to show you. Okay, before I get started, I thought I would mention that I'm gonna show raw meat. I always try to give like a little disclaimer. So about to have some raw chicken in the frame. Just so you know. I do, I have like three pieces of chicken. I usually just buy a package. It's just Jay and I. So we'll either eat the extra one or have leftovers. You can do four, you can do three, you can just do two, whatever you want. I wrap each chicken breast in a, with a piece of bacon. You can do more than one if you want. I just find that one usually works for most medium sized chicken breasts. And then what I'm gonna do is I have about a half of a stick of cream cheese. I think that's like four ounces. You can do more or less. I use, I just estimate all of this for the most part. I used to just use cream of mushroom soup and a little cream cheese, but I started making it myself because I think it tastes better and then it's also like less, um, you know, it's not all pre, this is all in a package, but it's not like a pre-mixed thing of soup that has who knows what. So I just use cream cheese, sour cream, milk, a little mayonnaise and some sliced mushrooms. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and open these cans and rinse them and pour them on here, I might use one, I might use two. It just depends how many mushrooms you want. That's my dishwasher going off. So I'm gonna do that right now. So I just poured one can of the mushrooms on top. I decided that I'm gonna go ahead and use the other can, um, but I'm gonna mix everything up the sauce wise and then pour the mushrooms on top. So I just did one small can on top of the chicken and then I'll do one on top. And I'm gonna go ahead and mix this up and I'll show you as I mix it. So I will just eyeball the mayonnaise, probably two tablespoons. Sour cream, about two tablespoons of that. Mix it all up and see what kind of consistency I have. Let me add a little more sour cream. Then I'll just add a little milk to loosen everything up. make it super easy to pour. Then I'll just go ahead and pour this all over. I always put it extra on there. You probably don't need that much. I know it looks gross right now, but I promise it's gonna be really good. But um, I like, I make it with rice, so I like to make extra sauce for my rice. Then I'll just pour the rest of the mushrooms on top. Put the lid on. And you can definitely cook this in your oven if you want. I'm just going to turn this on. I love this um, slow cooker, crock pot, whatever you want to call it. Mine's sturdy. Um, and then I'm going to set mine to high for four hours because I don't have as much time. But you could do low for six or eight, whatever. So I really like cooking that in the crock pot just because it's it'll be ready for dinner. And then I, I could show you a dinner time, but I'll show you right now. I, you can get these at Trader Joe's. You can get them at any grocery store. I just buy frozen rice. I literally pop it in the microwave and then serve those together. You can make a salad or like some steamed vegetables, sauteed vegetables. I think I'm gonna saute some green beans. So it's really easy. Everything's pretty much done. 
you can really prepare this all in advance and you can even like prepare it if you want to bake it in the oven you could just mix it all up put it in a pan keep it in the refrigerator and then when you get home from work you just pop in the oven probably like 350 375 for an hour hour and 30 minutes the longer it cooks like slower you can cover it it'll just like soak everything in and then once it's done the chicken just falls apart it's so yummy so now i'm gonna clean this up that's cooking and i can do some work Are you always napping? Always. You're so cute on your little Santa blanket. Oh, you don't want to be bothered because it's nap time. <laughs> so funny guy. Okay, it's around, I always say okay, and I'm trying to not say um, which is like really hard. <laughs> but, not okay, not um, but it's four o'clock about four o'clock and I am gonna do some more laundry. I have done, I don't even know how many loads of laundry today. Mondays are usually my laundry days. I'm gonna put you guys down really quick. Mondays are, well, I'm not gonna lie. I don't wanna just say Mondays are my laundry day because I feel like every day is my laundry day. I'm not kidding. I don't know how two people, just Jay and I, can go through like and dirty so many clothes, but I'm gonna fold some more laundry. Mondays are usually my sheet washing days and I have to, I will wash my sheets, fold them, iron my pillowcases, redo. Sorry, I hope this is like okay with you guys. I mean, everybody has underwear um, and I'm just like folding all different kinds of things. But I, I usually keep like two pairs of sheets, so I will wash one set and put them, fold them and put them away, pull out the other set from the week before, put them on the bed, iron my pillowcases because I do iron my pillowcases. It's like not essential and it really, it really does not take me a long time to iron my pillowcases. If I'm feeling extra special, I iron my top sheet, which I really, there's nothing like getting in a bed with sheets that have been ironed. I'm not even kidding. It's just the best thing in the world. But so I will do all of that on Mondays and I usually do my grocery shopping. But thankfully, if you watch yesterday's vlog, Jay and I did on Sunday. So that takes a little less stress off of me. I just hate doing a ton of cleaning on the weekends and I just fit all the other cleaning in whenever I have time. And to be honest with you, our house is never extremely clean. We are kind of going back and forth right now on hiring somebody to come in and clean every so often honestly we can we have the luxury of like being able to afford it i'm at home all the time so i do feel like it's my job to clean but when i am trying to work and do the million other things that i have to do it just doesn't get done and i think it would really benefit us to invest in someone that could come at least like do like the floors and just simple things every other week or something like that so I don't know if you guys hire somebody to do that let me know what you what your thoughts are I just really feel like sometimes when you're like trying to grow a business or things you have to really consider where is your time best allocated and I'm not great I mean I I don't mind cleaning I like cleaning but um when I have so many other things to do it really just doesn't get prioritized and I have enough things to do like the laundry and the daily dishes and making the bed and all the other things um but I just sometimes I feel like it'd be worth it to spend a little bit of money and kind of allocate that stuff out to somebody else. So let me know what your thoughts are on that. I'm gonna finish folding the laundry and then I'm gonna start addressing our Christmas cards. We've literally had them for probably close to two weeks and I have not addressed them. So I'm gonna show you guys a sneak peek. I always order our Christmas cards from Minted. I almost ordered them from somewhere else this year but I just wasn't sure and I love the ones that I got. So. If you want to receive a Christmas card from us, I did this last year, send me a DM or my email is in really, okay, the email will be the best. Send me an email. My email is in the description bar. It's just timelesstasteblog at gmail.com and send me your mailing address and I will drop one in the mail for you. <laughs> but I'm going to finish folding the laundry and then I'm going to get working on addressing some Christmas cards because I have to get them all addressed and sent out and I don't even know. So that's that. <laughs> Alright, 
I just did some Christmas card addressing. My, uh, what's it called? The dishwasher's going off again. I just addressed some Christmas cards. I'm getting some green beans out of the fridge. And I just, am bur I'm running out of steam. <laughs> it's Monday, it's been a long day. I'm just running out of steam. Right, Quim? You see me? So I, the chicken, I'm gonna show you. I, for the last hour, I just took the lid off cause it was like not very, it was kind of runny. But I took the lid off and like let some of the steam out and it, the, the sauce thickened up. So I'm gonna go ahead and saute some green beans. Jay is on his way home from doing some work. He's like been in and out of the house all day, like meetings and all kinds of work from home. So. I'm gonna cook the green beans. I think I have to snap the ends off maybe of these and throw them in the pan, salt, pepper. Probably that's about it for tonight. And then um, I'm gonna put the rice in the microwave and we'll be ready to serve up in just a few minutes because I am hungry because I ended up not eating lunch. I just ate some peanut butter. Like a few tablespoons of peanut butter. Does anybody else do that? I don't know. Why you look so serious? You look so serious. Hey. He's really hungry and I forgot to give him his pill until 4.45 and you're supposed to wait a whole hour until after you've had your pill to eat your dinner. We can't, we're not gonna be able to wait a whole hour. Clips. Clips, can I have a kiss? Can I have a kiss? Oh. No, I can eat a kiss. little kissy. Mm -hmm. No? No kiss? Come give me a kiss. Okay, no kissy. Okay, we just have some green beans, olive oil, salt, pepper, and a little butter to saute. Okay, mine ended up looking a little bit messy, so here's Jay's. Um, but yeah, that's what we're having for dinner. Okay, I figured, sorry, I was just eating something. I figured this would happen sooner or later, but I forgot to end the vlog last night. So, I'm ending the vlog this morning, starting Vlogmas day six. This is crazy, it's going by so fast and it's so hard to keep track of. Um, anyways, starting Vlogmas Day 6 right now, Diesel is eating um, his breakfast. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe, watch the other Vlogmas videos. I will link to all of them down below and we will see you guys tomorrow.